Hi guys, welcome back. It's me, Joy's Love, the number one imprints, and I'm going to be doing a love reading for my Libras. My gods and goddesses, welcome back. How you guys doing, by the way? I would appreciate it if you guys like, subscribe, comment, and share. Hit the bell on the side for all the updated videos when I post them. If you like a personal reading or donate to the channel, the information will be in the description box below. Now let's get into the reading. Let's see what's on and popping for my Libras. Okay, Libras, right now, you got the Page of Swords. So, you can be dealing with someone that's controlling, someone who's watching your every move, someone who is, that you really love and adore. Or, it can be vice versa. You can be um, this controlling person that's, you know, um, watching everything that your partner does. Okay, where your partner is, where your partner, who your partner talking to, and you just feeling like, you know, you feel like that you just really want to give your person the love that you have inside of you, but you are torn. Okay, you are torn because you want to take action on moving forward and being in love and having, you know, this warm, um, beautiful connection. But you feel like that your person, um, like you don't trust your person, that your person can be, you know, like playing with your emotions or, you know, telling you lies and um, keeping secrets, you know, and it's putting you in a bad state, you know what I'm saying? It's making you, you know, look back. It's it's like pouring alcohol on a on a half closed wound. Okay? It's burning and steaming and it's um you know it's 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 cleaning you a bit, you know, because you're learning, but in the same breath, you have to go through these sad emotions of reliving the pain. Okay, so you're really just wanting to get back to yourself and, you know, start socializing a little bit more and, you know, just showing your love, you know, because you do have luck on your side at this time and it's time for, you know, you feeling like it's time for you to take action towards your happiness. Okay, it's time for you to dress up, you know, put your suits on, put your nice dress or skirt on, and go out on the town and enjoy yourself, you know. If you just need to go over to a friend's house, put on you some jogging pants and some gym shoes, feeling comfortable. You just really ready to get out and socialize, okay. But it's some fast communication that's going, that's going to come in and you guys are going to talk, you know. Your person wants to, you know, get it to together, saying that they want to, you know, rekindle the flame, that they're going to do better, they really want to, you know, be the one for you, but this got you, you know, this situation, you know, this person always make you feel left out in the cold and alone, and you always go back to your sadness, okay, and you're really just trying to heal from this situation, and, you know, move forward, you're, you're ready to, you know, say what it is that you feel, and you're ready to approach the situation, and um, set your standards and boundaries, you, you don't want to, you know, listen to other people's opinion about your person, and you just want to put the smoke, put the, the past in the past, because you're tired of reliving it, you're tired of the darkness, you're tired of the sadness, you're tired of feeling not held by this person, you know, like this person, you know, got ill intentions on you, that this person is lying. You, you're really over that energy. So now you're being, you know, my queen of swords, my bitch. You know what I'm saying? She come through. She said what she got to feel. You know, she said what she want to say. She, um, you know, express herself and, and not caring about, you know, the person at hand, you know, 
that's just how, how she feel because she done put up with so much and now she ready to burst down and say, I'm ready to take action towards my future. I'm ready to get things um, on a happier note. I'm tired of being up in this dark energy. I'm tired of uh, reliving the past and keep on, you know, going over and over and over again and, and um, getting the same result. Okay? This, yo, you are standing up and you're realizing you're not insane. Okay? That you don't, you, you want to take, you know, your time. You ready to, you know, get it right. I'm ready for love. It's like you're going through a lot of mixed emotions of, you know, this person ain't giving me what it is that I want. But I love this person to death. I just want to... Um, uh, equal give and take what I put in. Why it's so hard for me to get it at get get the same thing in return? Outcome and advice for this situation for my Libras. Bottom of the deck, tower card. Something is gonna click. You know, with this tower card being here, something is going to click to where you're going to realize and see, you know, the main reasons why things are, you know, how they is. Okay. And you're going to have to, you're going to, you're going to have to make this choice and a decision on what it is that you need to do. It's time for you to stand up and stop being too comfortable in your misery. Okay, it's time for you to make a choice and a decision on where you want to go. Make that judgment call. What you want to do, you in charge of you and your life. It's time for you to stand up and accept what God saw spirit got for you. And stop sitting down pouting and your, giving yourself a pity party. Answer the call. Make the choice and the decision so that you can get the the um the wish that you always wanted. Tower card. Let it fall out. Y'all falling anyway. Let it fall out so you can get the the um new love that you deserve and let go of that toxicity. Let go of that liar. Break the chain of the toxicness that's in your in your life and get the blessings and the new beginning that God saw spirit got for you. You deserve it. You planted plenty of seeds. God is ready. God saw spirit universe. Whoever you pray to is ready to give you a hand of abundance, peace, joy, happiness, Freedom. Close that cycle out so you can get your happiness. Look at that. Beautiful cars. Just beautiful. Okay? You can do it. You can do it, Libras. I'm your cheerleader. You can do it. You you can do it. Okay? Um, I'm going to give you an oracle card to sum this up. Thank you, Spirit, for this reading. My oracle card for my Libras. Okay. One oracle card for my. That's too many, Spirit. I know you want to tell them a lot, but I just need one. That's it. Thank you. Okay, let me give you one love oracle too. One love oracle for my Libras. Okay. All right, so you have the eight of air. An illusion of being trapped, a lack of self-confidence, afraid to take action. Is that what it is, Libras? Libras, you can do it. I'm telling you, you can do it. 
an illusion. You you making yourself feel trapped. You're you're making yourself um, be trapped. You know, not knowing what choice and a decision to um, make. You, I told this is a mental state. You're putting yourself in when you over, um, when you overthink about a situation, fear starts to build. Okay, so you're gonna have to stop ruminating about situations and make the choice and decision that you know is good for your life. Okay, because you need to, you're doing this to yourself. Gain your confidence level up. And it's time for you to take action on your happiness because you deserve it. Okay? If you have to do your affirmations, I am strong. I am determined. I am love. I am peace. I am um, majestic. I am. You know what you want to be to build yourself up. Okay? Your last, your last card, your love oracle is passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. All right. Do the things that make you happy so that you can, you know, feel the love within you and radiate that in your aura and all around you so you can attract that same type of passion towards you because you deserve it. Okay? Well, good luck with everything. But please continue to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Thank you guys for being patient with me as well. Um, it's me, Joyce Love, the number one empress. I love you guys. Be safe. And um, if this energy resonates with any of you, please put a comment down below. Wash your hands, wear your mask, and till next time, peace out.